Hey everybody, welcome back to KI Cup. Awesome announcement, more tournament support. It's always a good time to play yep. KI, to hashtag play KI at all times, free to pick up. Just go ahead and play. Yeah. I mean, it's like one of those things where if you uh, have a computer that works, you yeah, can go ahead and play some Killer Instinct. A lot of people are kind of surprised by this, but it is no longer an Xbox exclusive, and it yes. has been that way for a little while. So if you guys want the game, it is available on the Windows 10 Store. Yes. And uh, it is free to play. And there's like there's a free character rotating, so if you yeah. don't like that character, you just like wait a week or two, and yeah. they switch there around. And I mean, like, the full version of the game with all the characters has been on sale, like, a billion times. Yeah, so. like, man, you can get it. You can get every single character in the game if you just wait for a sale every once in a while. Right. Pretty cheap. And the tutorial is a super... Like, if you've never played a fighting game in your life, the tutorial is a great it's step. It's not bad. Yeah, it, it does a great job of teaching you just the basics of fighting games. Mm -hmm. uh, and so even if you're, like, thinking about trying something else, maybe Killer Instinct would be a good start to just, you know... Hop in there and play uh, play that training mode and try to figure it out. A lot of the players that we've seen today also come from the online community of Killer Instinct because Killer Instinct has literal world class netcode. For sure, it is kind of almost unmatched in terms of its gameplay online. So uh, yeah. if you're worried about your experience or your tournament experience being altered because of online play, don't. Killer Instinct kind of has your back. But man, if we want to talk about a ridiculous grand finals, we have seen these two debut in matches earlier today. F3 Sleep using Arya and Storm using Hisako. And yeah. this went very much in Sleep's favor earlier. For sure. And uh, this is the important question, right? We, we talked about how last year Rico won Evo and then he followed it up with the Killer Instinct Cup win. Can Sleep do the same thing? Yeah. Can he close out and win Evo, which he did, and now also get Killer Instinct Cup at the opposite end of the year? It's super tough to stay consistent that long, but he has done it. He is in winner side grand finals. Versus Storm here, who's gonna he's gonna need two sets and need to close it out twice against Sleep to get the W, and we'll see if he can do it. Last time these two guys played it, it was pretty tough, uh, and I think a lot of that was really the zoning and just awareness from Sleep. Yeah. There we go, starting off grand finals, and Sleep is gonna take to the sky for a lot of this. His body gives her access to a float and an air dash that is really hard to deal with. Oh yeah, the empty low there. And this is the mix-up you run. You call the, the assist, you float, go to the other side, or stay in the front, and this is this is it. This is so powerful. The problem with Hisako is that even though she is catching the counter right now, the counter doesn't work against projectiles, and that projectile is nullifying it. Exactly. Air recapture. Sleep guess is wrong. This is huge damage. This is this potentially kill the body. Yeah, this should be the body. That's exactly what Storm wanted. Stab. All right. right at the end, and not, that, not that's a bad that. start. I mean, that's the kind of swing you could expect, right? Sleep started so strong, he was looking really good. Man, what a clutch block on that overhead. The last frame. Makes it safe. Yeah, you can shadow counter that if you're super on point, but it's very difficult to do. Where's the approach going to be? Did he wake up with a button, really? It was uppercut. Oh, it was uppercut, like. okay. Yeah, cancel right into that instinct. Storm riding a very little bit of amount of health right now. Any chip damage is going to do it. Wow! Tries to get out of there. Very hard when Arya has her instinct up. Yeah, exactly. So we'll see what it's going to be. Ooh, the chase down. Got to be worried about that command throw. And this pressure is super dangerous, but the escape. Back dash. Yeah, that was a great back dash. Yeah, she has one of the better back dashes. It goes real far. Oh, nice <laughs> tag on the I assist. I love it. I love it. Shadow counter and oh, the counter. Oh, can't do that against Osako. Yeah, not when she has that wrath. You have to be careful about that. It's that gauge you see in the bottom right, the green uh, bar that's filling up. Caught her and the doubles. Wow. Yeah. She teleported in. Yeah, that'll happen if you get hit airborne by that. Okay, try to catch Sleep Low. Storm, as we know, it can make that comeback when he has that instinct. Wow, break. I cannot believe these breaks from Sleep. The last two have been read breaks. They are not based on any visual information. Overhead. And, and that's going to do it. Bar. All of a sudden, these guys, actually, Storm is in the lead right now. This life bar is much more shallow. Oh, oh the counter. He knew he was going to start with oh. jump heavy. And the wow, break. So again. clutch. He got him. That should do it. That I think that's do enough it, right? now on the body. It oh is. my god, Storm takes the first game. Storm has to win five more games against Sleep's three. Right? Yes, yes, yes. He, he is a loser. Games. And man, you can see Sleep really thinking about it. And I think that's a confidence boost because Storm hasn't beaten Sleep's Aria yet today. Right. You can see, man, he looks so focused and yeah. ready. Grand finals of KI Cup. A lot of pressure with the assists right now. Also pushing Storm into the corner. He has he has such less escape room at the moment. Wow, that, that was a command genius. grab. Yeah, that was Good a call. super crazy read. Caught Can't the back dash now. 
bad spot to be if you're asleep. Does he break? Oh, he went for oh, the counter breaker. But I that, like it that Storm's going for longer combos, but man, I really wish he ended that one. Yeah, for sure. Potential damage is a big issue now for Sleep. Does he break her? This time he does, of course. Trying to save that body. Uh, now, now it's like, do you are you gonna break or should you counter break again? It's it's not a good situation for Storm. Might be against exactly in his favor. And Sleep didn't go for anything. Yeah, didn't even try to break. Was maybe predicting the counter breaker. Bad spot now. Oh, come and throw at the start. Sleep is for sure not in the lead now. Oh, the reset Another again. One. Will knock down though. Yeah, and one mix that was the great. potential. That was really good damage. Yeah, he had massive potential damage built up. Oh, as you can see on the backside of the other body. Oh, command throw. A command oh, throw. Oh, oh, straight into it, and that's going to avoid it because the projectile vulnerability. Genius. Wow. Genius. Super smart play from Storm. Good block. Caught the back dash Man. again and draining tons of life from Dude, sleep here. Storm is making crouching medium kick look like the greatest button in the world. Man, it is a good button, but his use of it is incredible. You can see sleep is so low now. Storm with a Storm with lead. a great break. Still in supreme victory territory. And oh man, all he needs is chip. All he needs is chip. I can't, dude. Storm is playing out of his mind right now. Yeah, this is a big issue. The blade body is already in danger, and that's that. Too this old. is just that. That was a dominating round. Um, I am sleep is see sleep is considering character changes right now in his head, and I don't know if that's a good idea because. He did very well earlier today against this character. It seems that like somebody flipped the switch in Storm's head, and he is playing just insanely well. He's For making sure. the greatest of reads, and his spacing is immaculate. And Sleep's really got to think about this now. The way Storm is playing, it's so incredible, and he, he's got to be concerned. All right, he's, he's, he's going to test one more game because he can lose this. Yes. He has three more matches after this one. Yeah, Storm wins. This will be a reset. So this is what Sleep needs to do. He needs to start establishing this space because Hisako can't counter the assists. Only can counter what Arya does. Right. Dash cancel pressure, but doesn't get anything out of it. Whiff counter. Big punish. It's the shadow. Yeah, Sleep wants to get as much damage as possible. Oh, and the uppercut. What a very, race. Very late, too. Ooh, wrong button. Down medium punch, and there it is. Great, great, great. So nearly start. a perfect round from sleep. Yeah. Making some adjustments. Wow, Ooh, that was it. Oh, and then the counter. counter the approach that looked ridiculous. Yeah, she was trying to slide in there to punish and save the body. Oh, yeah, the oh, mix up was too the high. Shot. Okay, the medium break. Clutch medium break. It's on the uh, medium linker that she was in the middle of. Assist. Oh, I think Storm is really trying to hit the butt, hit hit the robots. Yeah, those assists that uh, he's bringing out. Oh, that's a cross up. Oh, that's staying in the front. What a Where? block! Did that actually land? It did. Yeah, it was right in the front, and uh, it's a scary mix up for sure. Assist and sleeps in such a good position now. Yep, oh, straight for it. This is gonna be this is gonna be an almost impossible comeback because yeah. as soon as Arya gets instinct, it's it's, it's difficult to block everything. Yeah, he's going to need a miracle here. Most of his instinct has weared out now. He's going to have that instinct activation available. And as you mentioned, it's so tough at that point. Yeah. Ch I mean, Chip is a big problem, too. Oh, and that no, it's close. It's yeah, a good chip. break, but uh, it's a noble effort. Chip, chip, chip. And that's going to be it. Yeah, there's no shadow counter to available. Deal with it. Okay, so Sleep is making some adjustments. This is exactly what he needs to do. He needs to rely more on his assist mix-ups. Because that, that, that absolutely locks Hisako in a position where she really can't move. Right. And we have seen that Storm has escaped those. He just jumped up back through some of them. And I'm curious if he's going to find a way to get out of them again. And after that two, quick 2-0, Sleep really made an adjustment that's important. And he's pouring a lot into this, you know. He is really, it's, it takes a lot to get this set. And, you know, you got to imagine if he ties it up 2-2 and loses. Yeah, man. That is a bad feeling. you got a whole new set, and Storm's going to be all fired up. We know that Storm is not going to be switching characters. He's been doing this all night. Goes back to character select just to give himself a little bit of a break and to remove the momentum that goes into the next round. God, who, who would have thought that the... I mean, Arya, I'm not super surprised, but at the same time, Hisako in grand finals of the, the most competitively stacked Killer Instinct tournament ever. It's just how the game That's goes. There's so many characters that are viable at a super high level. Absolutely. If there's one thing, the balance of the game is... Pretty good. If you look up that matchup chart that Keats has released, it's kind of crazy how close everyone is. Yeah, I mean, we've seen the majority of the cast today, so now mix up Sleep Man. Oh, and the oh, early counter breaker. Huge read from Sleep. 
big message to send in this game, and that, that's what you got to do. You got to send them out and be like, look, this is the way we're playing. This is how I'm playing. Cross up. The mix ups are so dangerous Saka right now. Is locked down in the corner right now. Dash up throw hasn't done that yet. Oh, with. Not a big punish. And oh, ready for totally the teleport. Heavy doubles, and this time no breaker. You were scared of the counter. Mix up. Gonna be going behind. Oh, oh enough I thought it was maybe. I don't know. Is it in waste? I'm surprised it didn't waste as much instinct as possible. Yeah, I'm not sure what the plan was, but now I'm gonna be floating away. Those assists are out there to cover Sleep I and think the approach. I think Sleep is completely confident that he can keep his Sako out right now. Didn't even need to waste the instinct. Oh, short combo goes for the reset. Caught him. And that's, oh, a, that's lockout. a big lockout. Potentially death. Oh, he extended How a little too far. How did he know that was going to be a light linker? Yeah, because that's the fastest one, right? So that's he wanted true. to try to do something really quick to cash out the combo. Clutch breaker from Sleep. And the flow, oh, he's just gone. He's out of there. Storm is doing his best to try to knock one of the assists out after they strike. And then there he goes. He got it. Gonna have to start milking damage oh. off of them somehow. Okay. This is a big opportunity now for Sleep. Flips him out. And the jump back from Storm. He's not out of this yet. Oh, caught the back dash. Okay. And his body he's is definitely down. not out of this, but he has to deal with the damaging body now, which is the blade body. Lacks sure. the mobility. Oh, that could be it. Double shadow, and the cash yes. out. Ooh, One more hit away. Chip, Chip will do it. Chip will do it. Yeah, and th this should be it. He should be able to call the drones. He's gonna force a shadow. Oh, and, and there we catch. go. We are at game point for Sleep in Killer Instinct Grand Finals. Sleep's adjustments have been have been ridiculously on point now, yeah. and he has he has followed his game plan all the way back to 2-2. Two, two. He was down two games just now. He has had a lot of success with Arya versus Sasako earlier in this For tournament. Sure. And now Storm has to make adjustments on his end and has to change everything once again. Yeah, you see Sleep. He's super, super focused. He's really brought this back, as you mentioned. He, he's found that kind of rhythm that he would, he had before when he played against Storm, right? He had that quick 3-0. Maybe that was it. Maybe he just had to find the rhythm once again. Yeah, get used to the way he was playing earlier. He was looking fantastic, and he's looking great now, for sure. All right, so here we go. This is potentially the last game of KI World Cup if Sleep wins. However, if Storm wins, we are getting a grand finals reset. Yes, I know. And it's the that. next best of three. So potential last game of Killer Instinct Cup coming up. Sleep, he's going to look to try to close this out. And the most important thing is that he stays airborne. Yeah. He avoids those scrambles that uh, Hisako gets Yeah, Hisako's been winning the scrambles. If Sleep is able to get his mix-ups established, then it's all, it's going in his favor every single time. And here we go. It's already starting. Yeah, it's the ground to throw. Mix-ups now. Strong Mix committing to the counter, missing it. Oh, and he's, man, these mix-ups are really this working out for Sleep. This is going really good for Sleep. Already losing about, already, already draining about half the life bar. Big catch. And I think Sleep stuck around a little too long. Storm's response is going to be huge right now because this this is going to be a lot of damage. Splat. Overhead? Nope. Command throw right Go for after. the knockdown. And this is the spot. This is what you need a Storm. Chase down on the back dash. Little pressure. Floats out. And he just floats escapes. right out. Okay, so Sleep has reset the situation. That's exactly what he needed to do. Very smart from Storm to actually smack the assist, preventing its usage for a couple seconds. Yeah, and the heavy doubles, no breaker on that. Storm does have instinct available now. Cross up. Wow, where was that going? Oh, oh catch the up. same thing happened again. And, and the lockout. Storm missed the combo breaker. Sleep takes the first life bar. He's in a massively good position here. Storm really got to bring this back. He's not that far behind. If he can get rid of this body, things will be about evened up. Oh, but the low no lands. And mix-ups again. He's going to run the mix-up. First established combo. Sleep also has access to a ridiculous amount of meter. His damage output is going to be insane if he gets another lockout. And this damage is really adding up. Chip, mix-ups. Oh, that's big. Counterbreaker. Sleep that getting a little anxious. Oh, and a reset. Okay. okay. All right. Storm has taken out the first body. He is. He only has a half life bar left. Versus two of Sleep's. And Sleep, he's got that instinct available. It's so dangerous. The mix-ups behind it. Activation. The shadow counter is baited. Did he get it, though? He nope, got the it hit. didn't come out. And the big damage, Sleep so close. Next combo's gonna do it for Sleep. Antier misses. This could be it, slaps the drone out of the way. Storm, Storm trying his best to stay alive. Oh, the teleport oh, out of the man. way. Oh my. 
scary. He's he, the avoidance is fantastic <laughs> right now, but still, he needs more than avoidance. He needs damage. Sleep is playing ridiculously solid. He is not taking any unnecessary risks. Oh, the uppercut oh, until he does that. Caught her out of the air. Combo. Big chance. Okay, this is a big chance, but this is going to take a miracle. Sleep can smell the victory. Oh, no. Oh, the empty whiffs. jump low and whiffs. And he got through and with the shadow uppercut. And that does it. Sleep takes it with the shadow uppercut. Is your EVO champion, the latest EVO KI champion and Killer Instinct World Cup 2017 champion with Arya. The two big ones, back to back, back to back. And he did it last year. Rico did the same thing. Now Sleep has done it, and he talked all day about he was the guy to be. He said, yeah, who, who is the person to be here? I am the person to be here. You have to give him credit. He was right. He was right the whole time. He was right the whole time. And what a set that was, Storm, you know. The first set that they played, obviously, went Sleep's way 100%. But, man, what a way to bring it back. And what a run from Storm. Yeah, what a run. I mean, I, I feel the MVP of this tournament was actually was actually Storm. Sleep is the winner, but Storm has showed a a level of of just superb prowess with his Sako, a character oh, that has a huge amount of kind of issues in her matchups. And my god, man. And look that at was... that trophy, man. What a moment for Sleep. Evo gets the Killer Instinct World Cup as well. And that's got to be a good feeling on the year. You know, he didn't get every tournament, but to get the two big ones, the ones where everybody was dumping everything they had into it. What a moment for Sleep. <laughs> I would not hand that trophy away. Yeah, <laughs> that's a dangerous time. But man, what a victory he got there. Sleep, the Killer Instinct World Cup champion. And it's, it's got to feel good, man. He had a couple of close ones. I mean, even last year, he was close to, you know, being the champ here at KI Cup. And I think even during his last big victory, which was Evo, he, like we said, he won the final game with Gargos, but pretty yeah. much played the entire tournament with Arbiter. Right. And was notably also an Aria player at that time. Yeah, so exactly. So it was just, just a choice, and he had stuck throughout the majority of this tournament with Aria. Man, and what a, what a tournament it's been. It's been so crazy. There's been ups and downs. I'm just glad it wasn't like a 3-0 blowout. Oh, for sure. End. Like yeah. Storm was able to able to keep his cool and for a second there it's like, "Oh my, does he have did he figure this out? Is it about to happen?" Like it was it was kind of crazy, but Sleep stood strong and showed the power of Arya and yes. actually controlled that space, which is exactly what we were saying should happen and oh, he yeah. did it. He played super well and I I mean, you know, that this is one of those tournaments where everybody uh, was bringing out everything they had, and yeah. it was super tough to make it that deep. We had so much character variety. It was like over 21 or 22 characters yeah, out of the lot. 29 available. Yeah, It's a ton of character variety. Uh, if you guys missed any of the action today, definitely check out the archives. Try to get more of those matches. It was it was a lot of great KI today. There was yeah. tons of great sets from start to finish. Even in top eight, there were some of the yeah. closest, craziest matches I've seen in this game in a, in a long time. And that's been one of the most delightful things about commentating Killer Instinct top eights has been, man, the games get so close. Yeah, they do. Uh, it is a it is a beautiful game. Try it if you get a chance. Hashtag play KI. It's a lot of fun. And yeah. uh, I'm trying to think if we're going to go back. Which characters were you anticipating that could possibly have won this tournament? Like, yeah, I mean, to me, the characters that stand out were I kind of like my big three in this version of the game, which are Jago, Fulgor, Arya. Yeah. Uh, very, very, very strong characters, and the, you know they perform well. The players all perform well. It was a super awesome event. Mm -hmm. I'm really happy that I got to be here for Killer Instinct Cup. It's two years in a row that it's happened, and I couldn't be you know happier to talk about this game at any time. Yeah. Like you, you just put me in front of this game, and I'll talk about it for the rest of my life. It's such an awesome game, and it's an amazing experience to be here with everybody. Yeah. Um, we're three seasons in now, yeah. and there's even more coming. And other characters being added on March 21st. If you guys want to check out Shin Hisako, and then right. there's another character after that that we don't know anything about. There's more, more ultimates. We're getting like literal fatalities for a bunch more characters, yes. which is uh, always fun and nice little flourishes. A lot of people have been asking for. Yeah, and that's gonna just about do it for Killer Instinct Cup 2017. Thank you guys a ton for watching, and I think that just about does it. Say, Jam, thank you a ton, man. It's been a always pleasure. a blast. Take care, guys. See you guys.